What is up everyone? Welcome to the episode of Manitoba Fishing Adventures. We are back out here on the Red River in search of some catfish, except this time I got a fly rod. I'm gonna try catching one on a fly rod, which I haven't done in like six or seven years. I got Colton and Trav out with me today. Trav hasn't been catfishing in a few years, eh? Never. It's, oh, he's never. So we're gonna, we're gonna get him his catfish virginity today and get that taken and off the board. So we're just gonna get set up. Tulabee is the game plan for bait today. And this orange pumpkin fly that I tied up like five years ago, I'm gonna try it with that. So stay tuned and hopefully we'll get on some kitties. Set the hook. Hold on, tighten the drag, tighten the drag a bit. I'm gonna leave this here. Hopefully this doesn't get taken. Get this camera. Oh, I hope it doesn't go on my line and take my... Lots well, of big in, eh? Yep. Jeez. Jeez Louise, my man. Nope, reel down. I'm gonna start to, yeah, and then pull up. There you go, just like that. That was fucking too less. Whoa, 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 what's with the F bomb? Sorry, master. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, every time I have spits in my mouth. Yeah, well, start eating some more spits. Listen, if you catch one more, I'm gonna have to get you to stop and I'm have to try fly fishing here, my man. Well, that's a big one too, that's a nice one. Ho oh, ho! And it wants to run still, eh? Oh, yeah. No way. Walk, walk to it, walk, walk towards it. Hopefully the mic is a little bit nicer today and it's in properly. Jesus, eh? You gotta love catfishing. Okay, just uh, stay there, bring in a little bit more, then I'll hold the rod in after. Falls in the water. Now this is the last one. Let's see if we can get that hook out. Oh, that was good. Need a pair of pliers or what? Yeah, I think so. Oh, there we go. Nice fish, my man. Second one. Let's go. Ready for this release? Oh yeah. This beauty release right off the rock. All right, come on, buddy. It's not a salmon. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. There you go. Slowly going back in. That was a good fight. That, that was, was tired. That was a good fight. That was a little tired. Cool. All right, Trav. Your, turn. your turn, pal. My your turn. turn. Oh yeah. Hey. <laughs> Got to reel down to this now. Oh, wow. I don't know if it's a cat or not, though. Oh, it's a pike, out of all things. Really? Out of all things. Oh. 
<laughs> Out of all things. Really, pal? I guess it's still fun on a fly rod, but still. Not really what I was uh, hoping for. Hey! Ugh. I guess one fish on the fly rod is better than no fish on a fly rod. I think. Little one. But hey, better than nothing. Dang it, I thought that was a cat. Mm. Let's go boys, get a couple more fish. Have you recasted yet or no, Colton? Whoa, fish, 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 fish. Oh my God. Woo. You just do it. Holy smokes. That took me and just started peeling, bro. Holy smokes. Oh. Oh. Woo. No way. Oh. This could be it, folks. This could be it. Oh my god, my arm is so sore now. No. Yeah, I, I haven't seen it yet. I think it's catching. It hit me and started running. Oh man! <laughs> oh. This would be a bad time for that rod to go. Yeah, yeah. She comes here. My arm is so sore. Well, we put this in the water. Because why not? There it is. First one on the fly rod, ladies and gents. Fly right in the corner of its mouth. I just talked to Mr. Brian Rappinchuk. He said, try black. I've been trying a green pumpkin slash orange and uh, this did the trick. Not a big one, but first one for sure. All right, it's gonna go back and release her now. I am totally getting water in my boot right now, but she put up a fight. Now let's get one like twice the size and we'll see what they can really do. Cool. Awesome. So I'm taking a little break, folks. Going over some gear really quick. I'm using a 10 foot, 10 weight, four piece Reddington fly rod and a, a 10, 11, 12 reel with some 10 weight floating line and then with nine feet of 25 pound fluorocarbon. I got this icy buff here and because it's made out of ice, it actually keeps me cooler than any other buffs like a camel buff, for example. So if you can find an icy buff, you'll stay cooler on these hotter days. But Got a little black fly on because I lost the one I actually caught the catfish on, unfortunately. But we got what, two fish? Colton's got two. Couple broken lines by Trav. Beautiful day right now though, so we're just gonna sit back, enjoy, and I'll get back to fishing really soon. So, hope you like the video. Get Trav set up over here on his run. Good eye, Colton. When you hear that drag going like that, it means it's not really in. If you feel it fighting though, just let it uh, let it run. Oh, there's some old smoothie right there. That'll be great for the intro. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> oh. My man's not not gonna lie, I casted that one, folks. <laughs> I had to put it in the right spot for the youngsters. Oh, you're fucking. Oh. Yeah, nice, nice. Wow, you're nice. really. You know, pulling I'm surprised. Because people always talk to me like, wow, like, he's been on your videos a lot and he still swears. I'm like, yeah, I, I just don't get it. Is it people talk about me? Yeah. I knew yeah. I was a big uh, big part of the. Big, big shot, big shot of the show. <laughs> okay, got a little bit slower now. Just. 
Just the nice one. Hey, pal. Oh, welcome to the show. My name's Josh. I'm the host. Uh, uh, why are you so slimy? Has fall. There you go. Yeah, his first oh. one. Let's go. Get a little scar on it. Okay. Release her back to the wild. Just splash her before you watch it. Oh no, nice and slow. See you later. Bye. Bye. Oh. Nice fish. <laughs> yeah, nice swearing. My bad. <laughs> well, that wraps up the day, folks. We got a total of six cats uh, all together. I got one on the fly rod, one little pike on the fly rod, so I did accomplish one thing I set it to do. Trav got his very first one. He is uh, pretty excited. We just gotta give him some little heavier pound tests. And Colton, uh, Colton's getting better. He was trying to give Trav some casting lessons and uh, didn't end up working out too well. But hope you enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe, and stay tuned to the next episode of Matt's Boy Fishing Adventures.